It's a story that rocked our borough five years ago this week. Justin Hackley was a 20 year old college student who was shot and killed in Flatbush, East Flatbush. Now, years later, his family continues to mourn his death as they continue to look for the suspected second person police say is responsible in his death. So we're going to get right out to our reporter, Phil Tate, who tells us more from Clinton Hill. Christy, moments ago, I spoke with the mother of Justin Hackley, and you can't help but to feel her pain. She says her son had one year left in college, had high hopes of becoming an investor and was robbed of his future. Well, just listen to how she describes these past five years. It's been a nightmare, unbearable nightmare. And we're still li living it because one of the brothers, which is Dean Bolin, is still at large. It's been five tough years for Marie Bernard. Her son shot and killed at 533 Ocean Avenue in East Flatbush back on July 11th, 2017. Police tell us the fatal shooting incident stemmed from a verbal dispute between two individuals and Hackley and his 24 year old friend. Bernard says her son was not involved and did not know these two men. Police identifying the two suspects in Hackley's death as two brothers, Rashid and Dean Bolin. Bernard played a major role in helping police arrest one of the brothers, Rashid Bolin, with a useful tip back in 2019. Rashid was arrested in Texas and charged with murder, assault, and criminal possession of a weapon. As police continue to search for Dean Bolin, who remains at large, Bernard says she hopes he will turn himself in. Give me that closure as a mother, because I've been waiting five years. I've been searching for Dean Bolin. Wherever he's at, wherever he's hiding, that I will, I'm pleading for him to come forward and just turn himself in. You know, don't just allow your, bro your brother to take the charges. Turn yourself in. And this mother's fight for justice continues. We did reach out to the Brooklyn District Attorney's Office, and they tell us Rashid Bolin's next court date is scheduled for August 4th. Well, that's the latest here in Clinton Hill. I'm Phil Tate, News 12. Phil, thank you for those.